Hey guys! Oh my god! How are you all doing today? Hi! We're here with another Empty Regrets and Reviews. I'm not going to say what number on because I ain't got a clue. <laughs> I'm just so far ahead with these. So, we're going to jump straight in. Oh, what should we pick first? We're going to go with hand creams. I have two. Both from Kev Kidston. One is a Novelty Bubbles and one is a Posy. Uh, do you know what? Both nice. Um, that one was a grower. I didn't love it straight away, but it definitely grew on me. They're paraben free, which I really, really like because I have monkey skin. But yeah, I'd be happy if I got them again. I would not buy them because I wouldn't pay the shipping for them. Because, yeah, that's the sort of person I am. Um, not when I can just go pick up a decent, cheap one from my local supermarket. Because um, the easiest place I can get them from is the middle of my town centre. And it's just annoying to get to. I don't really go in town that often. Like, I go in town, but I'm not going to go, oh, I'm just going to get the kids to get myself a hand cream. No. So, yes, I would be happy if I got them again. Yes, I would use them again. But now I would not go out my way to purchase them. I have some face wipes which isn't unusual these are from Aldi I keep saying I'm gonna get the reusable things but every time I get paid I'm not gonna pay enough moral bills <sighs> anyway I love them I keep buying them if you're ever in an Aldi in the UK check them out the next thing I have I'm flying through these today by the way we're not messing around today oh no 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 we have a beauty sponge it doesn't matter how much water I put on this, they they don't expand and they don't get any softer. Like, this is quite dense, thick, horrible. I just, I feel like you do it and I'm beating myself up. I didn't love it. I think he came from Spain. Like, I'm really grateful for it. Like, it, 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 rubbish. It's gone in the bin. I have these moments where I'm like, no, it's gotta go. Oh, I love these deep conditioners. I just love them. They smell so good. I think I got this in a glossy box. It smells so good. I love it so much. My hair feels amazing afterwards. What about skin? Yes. Yes, I would. I believe they sell these in my local supermarkets. And if I was there and for some random reason I fancied one, I would happily pick one up. Uh, so, yeah, definitely. And I got the deep conditioner, the moisturising deep conditioner. Oh, my God. I recommend these. I love them. They just think it's like it's like a treat for your hair. I just love them. I love them so much. The next thing I have is this collection's sheer loose powder. It looks like this. I had it in number one, barely there. It was kind of like just to, you know, go over everything. It did have the little thing on the top that stops you obviously tipping it all out. But I got that low. I had to empty it. And it's empty. And it was all right. It was all right. It wasn't the worst powder I've ever used. It was all right. I'd buy it again if I needed a powder. And I was in the shop struggling like, oh, which one shall I choose? I don't really know. Hmm. But yeah, I would, I'd definitely buy it again. It was about four quid and it's quite a large size. There's 20 grams worth of loose powder in here. It was decent size. So yeah. The next thing I have is a Rimmel London Wake Me Up Mascara. Mascara? <laughs> oh my God. Um, concealer. Now, just by the looks of it, it's, it's grim. I even removed the bulk. There is nothing left. I'll tell you why there's nothing left. Because I even stopped using this. Because you can never get that chunk at the bottom, can you? And started sticking a makeup brush in there. I got my money's worth. What about again? Yes. Yes, I would. It's not the first time I've brought that. It will most certainly not be the last. I have a lipstick. A liquid. Matte, matte, matte lipstick. Lip gloss? Lip gloss. We're going to say it's a lip gloss. It's more of a lipstick, but anyway. This is from Essentials. And it's number three, Girl of Today. It looks like this. It is a beautiful, beautiful shade. But when you put it on, it just doesn't dry down that colour. And it can dry quite thick. And I just... I just... I don't love it. I don't... I, 
You know when you just wear a lipstick and wear a lipstick and I'm like, I'm wearing this for the sake of wearing it and I'm just not loving it? That's what it was. Goodbye. I missed the box. Return it again. Goodbye. That was my bin. <laughs> That's my little bin box at the side of me. I liked it. I didn't love the formula. I just... I didn't love it. The next thing I have, I feel like I've got something on my face, just about there, and it's doing my nut in. It's probably, I went for a spider web earlier, it's doing my head in. Okay, the next thing I have is the Ordinary Hydroluronic Acid. Uh, 2% plus B5. It looks like this. Oh my god, I love this stuff. What am I to gain? Focus. Yes, I would. I loved it that much. This is not the second or third time I've brought this, I can't quite remember. It's great. It comes with a little dropper that is completely empty and I'm completely out of focus. Focus on my bottle. It comes with a dropper. Shall we try this again? <gasps> Bubble. Can you see that? Oh, but yeah. It got to the point that I actually tipped this upside down and like smudged it all over my face to get rid of it. I like The Ordinary. They make me happy. Would I buy it again? Yes. And I would recommend you to go and have a look. And the last thing that I'm heartbroken about, by the way. I don't want to bin it, but it just looks so dirty and tatty. And you know sometimes it's just time to come to an end with things. I had my Benefit Roller Lash. It is dry. It is horrible. It's like, ew. Like, I can get some mascara, but it's so thick and so dry. Oh. I loved it. I don't want a minute. I really, really like this mascara. It's just so goddamn nice. Oh. But it's going in the bin because it's empty. Want to buy it again? Yes! Yes, I would buy it again. I loved it. I absolutely loved it. I'm sad to say, say that's going to go without replacing him first. But <sighs> I feel so much better now I've got done that. Yes, I do love my roller lash. It's one of my favourite uh, all-time mascaras. And it's gone. <laughs> it's so dry. And it's probably so out of date. But anyway, we're just going to bypass that. Thank you so much for watching this Empties Regrets and Reviews. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I will promise to do my hair next time. Maybe not. But yeah, I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to check out some of my other Empties Regrets and Reviews. And don't forget, if you like you like if you would like to come back and see me again see this mug on your screen please click here to subscribe click here to check out one of my latest videos and click down here to see a video that youtube is selected for you thank you so much for watching take care i'll see you in a few days with another video and bye bye